Men's field specifically, we are talking about 21 men who have run sub two hour and 10 minute marathon pace. That is incredible and they will all be out here today at the start line behind me. And headlining that group is Elliot Kipchoge. Can't forget about him. No one will. They'll be watching him all day. He's from Kenya. He is the biggest name in all of marathon racing. Two others to watch in the men's professional, last year's winner, Evans Chibet of Kenya and Tanzania's Gabriel Gay. And back to Kipchoge, he's won 15 of the last 17 marathons he's entered and is the only person to ever run a marathon in under two hours. That was on a controlled course. He's also the world record holder with his two hour, one minute, nine second time set last year at the Berlin Marathon. This will be his first time running Boston and he tells us he's here to win it. My preparations actually has been going on well. Uh, I'm happy to put my feet in Boston Street. And uh, Monday actually, I think will be a great day and a great race. And to put it simply, this year's Boston Marathon women's elite field is stacked. Among them, first-time Boston runners that could post top times, including Lona Salpeter, that's Israel's national record holder, plus Amane Barizo from Ethiopia, and last year's epic Boston finish could ignite the revenge run for the 2022 second-place finisher, Ababel Yashana. The Ethiopian came in just behind the winner by a mere four seconds. Here's 2004 U.S. Olympian Carrie Tollefson. It is such an epic field that they've put together. You know, everyone at the BAA, they always do such a good job. But this year in particular, I mean, we have six of the top seven women that are coming back from the World Championships this summer. And we can't forget about Des Linden. Who could? She won the 2018 Boston Marathon in that torrential downpour. But the top American finisher in Boston for the last two years, you have to watch her this year as well, Nell Rojas, a former triathlete turned marathoner and now Olympic marathon hopeful. 15, a full 15 women have run this race in under two hours, 21 minutes. That's their marathon time. We'll see what they can do in Boston. You know, sometimes times are a little bit slower. We heard from Cindy about that headwind. That's something we'll be watching throughout the day today. From here, 